Good morning. Good morning, people of the world. I'm back at my uh, very lucrative job of making fishing videos. And uh, this morning, it is uh, high tide right now between Richmond Hill and Sunbury, Georgia on the Medway River. And I plan on catching fish. Last time I went at the beginning of this week, I caught some trout, but I didn't catch a whole lot. I don't always, I always video, but I don't always produce a video and edit it and all that kind of stuff. I just video, and then if I feel like it's something that you guys might enjoy, I'll make the video. Uh, <clears throat> now, of course, I like to make myself look really good and uh, video when I catch a lot of fish. And that's just me. Um, so let's see if today is a video. There's, there are many introductions, many introductions that have fallen on deaf ears where nobody has ever seen the video. It's very sad, really. But today, it, today's different. Today's, we're gonna do it. First out of the morning to ya. There he is. The friendly trout. Just wanted to stop by for a second. Say, how's it going? Hello. Good morning. How do you do? It's a beautiful little bank here. It's got a plenty of shrimp and bait on it. that's been trying to figure out where the fish are in relation to all this. And the tide's starting to come out, so there should be, there you go. There should be plenty of bait coming out of this little creek here, it's very little. And as the shrimp pulls out of it, you get big trout like this guy. All the trout like to, you know, take a shot. Could I be one of the trout to get to eat the shrimp coming out of the creek? You don't know till you try. So you got to get up in there. That's what that little guy did. He got up in there. See if there's a big guy. You know, he actually felt bigger than that last one. And he was a lot smaller. Mmm, mmm! That was a pretty decent trout. I lost him. You're not pleased. Not pleased with that. Little trout. So apparently catch the little ones. It's the big ones. Little guy. Good. It's good, clean fun. Right there. Good, clean fun. The bigger one is kind of more out away from that point. The one that got away 
if you know what I mean. God, he is the one that got away. That fish out there now, those fish, those fishes, they are the ones that get away. Okay, we'll have to a little bit smarter with those guys. Let's try it again. I can play this game. I can play this game. Chris has played this game once or twice. Let's go. Okay. It's not a game I'm looks like I'm gonna win right now. Let's go back to the little corner point right there. Touch better. Not a whole lot, but a little bit. A little bit. There he is. The colors, how pretty those fish are. Pretty, pretty fish. And pretty good to eat. They gotta be 14 inches here where I live to keep. I've got a bunch of them in the freezer. A bunch of them. Oh yeah. Ooh. This is a little better. A little better right here. Oh. It's a uh Light drum. What about that? A black drum. These are really good to eat. They're like redfish. They're relatives. Actually, the trout are relatives of the redfish and this fish, believe it or not. Even though. my kind of fishing. First place you stop at, you start catching fish. And you keep catching fish. There we go. It's on. It's on. A trout. Oh, a redfish. <laughs> fish okay trout redfish and they are gorgeous fish and a drum there we go right there Fun-sized. It's a fun-sized little trail. Take my shrimp. There's a horn right there. It starts right there. Put it right about where that horn starts. It's the hard part of his head. That way he can swim around. Throw him out there. Let him do what a shrimp does. Which is good eat get eaten by uh, fish. That's what a shrimp does. Go. Little trouts. Where's my big trout at? Just turned itself loose. He's a self-starter. You don't have to tell him what to do. Motivated. That's the kind of fish I like. Yeah. 
Got him that time. Got him that time. Expecting a little more, a little more uh, size of this fella. Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa buddy. Go. That's a lot of fun. Oh god, another sh another black drum. Yes, sir. I like it. I think those have to be 14 inches too to keep. I think. I might be wrong. Bad. This water is getting more and more shallow as the tide goes out, and the fish now are uh, getting more. Kind of out here, there's a point that comes off that grass right there, and they're getting more out there because the water's shallower up here. Okay, a little more decent trout. A little more decent trout. And jump in my bait bucket. And I'll tell you, he made my shrimp nervous. He really did. Lots of fish today. I got a spot that I want to visit because I hadn't fished there in a while. To see if there's any fish. But the number one rule, now I'm about to tell you the number one rule of fishing. And people break it all the time. I break it. Is don't leave fish to find fish. Now, if I was in a tournament, I might leave here because I'm not catching keepers. But if I'm catching fish, why would I leave these fish to find fish? The whole point of fishing is to find fish. So I found fish. But I am Want to leave? <laughs> I don't want to leave right here. Okay, I left fish to find fish. There's a little Did red fish. I told y'all not to do that, but the bite was slowing down.
Another black drum. That was kind of dramatic. My line got twisted around my reel. I couldn't reel it. Fish was on there. There was a lot going on. But I didn't panic. Redfish. Oh, that little hole right there. So it's two reds, one drop. So far back in this creek, everything's been redfish and drum. Another baby red. Red Dawn. It's Red Dawn. Today. Y'all see that movie? Y'all remember that movie? Of a day full of little fish. I mean, full of them. There's another. It's just been all day. Little guys. Good day. Glad y'all got to watch and hope y'all uh, get to go fishing very soon.